somebody tried to tag our spot. Oh, hell no. With their bullshit Columbus crew. Look at that 96. The, it's just garbage. Oh, fuck. You want to go first? That's already going. What, what you trying to pull out? You're already going if you want to bring the shit out. We got plenty to talk about today. guys. City workers giving us props. This is crazy. America's been a rule. 93% of the car right now. Bring that up. 222 out of 239 years since 1770. Six. I'll get close up on him with that so he can make sure the mic pick it up. What's that scripture of? Since thou has hated blood, since thou has not hated blood, blood shall pursue thee. Ezekiel 35 and 6 it says therefore as I live saith the Lord God I will prepare thee unto blood and blood shall pursue thee since thou hast not hated blood even blood shall pursue thee it says sit thou yeah because it says since y'all where to go yeah, since uh, since thou have not hated blood, blood shall pursue thee. Because America is a uh, bloodthirsty country. What was that? I don't know, some black, some black canine. <laughs> black see, she coming to still going back. I ain't there come over. I ain't come to you. You gotta come to me. That's your girl. She's stalking you, bro. All right, you gotta come to me. Um, let me read this. This is uh. What the brother sent me a couple days ago, this pie chart of America since 1776. America has been at war 93% of the time, uh, 222 out of 239 years since 1776. Yeah, this is the Roman Empire. It's the Roman Empire, that's, that's That, that's all. That's why the the Bible refers to America as a great beast, you know, the great red dragon. It's the Roman Empire. And what does a dragon do? It, it fucking it's a, a fire breathing dragon stomps, kills, and destroys. That's all he does. And lays waste. So that's why this country is likened unto a a dragon, unto a beast. Yeah, they refer to it as a dragon, like you said. Yeah, the red dragon. The red dragon. Plain and simple, the red dragon's talking about. No, there's no other country lays waste like America. They want to make you think all the other countries were uh, the evil empires. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But it's America that's the evil empire. And what's your boy Ron Paul? That's one main thing he'd like to come out with you know, how America is in, you know, like, got like 900 and something U.S. bases all around the world, man. That's one thing he likes to talk about. Yeah, because that's that Ron Paul. Well, yeah. He, actually, that's funny, too, because a lot of the Republicans don't like Ron Paul because well, he's a non-interventionist, is what he calls himself. He's against all those rules. You know what I'm saying? What's up, homie? Hey, can I, uh, set a bus pass? I don't know. I don't need a bus. Somebody get it from you. Waiting on the bus. Yeah, yeah. They get that with the quickness. A lot of people's down here that's walking. 
Yeah. They're just going to need it. Or just sit around and wait. Trust me, they're going to come by. They, they could do it every day. I found a new hustle, too. You're going to get some money. Yeah. I was thinking, I was at Aldi's the other day, and they got the little quarters you put in the carts. Mm -hmm. Everybody that leaves that carts, man, they don't take them back. Mm -hmm. You can sit out there and just rack up quarters all day. Yeah, because yeah. I'm going to do that same thing. Oh, yeah. I don't know if it's back. It's just a quarter. You know? I was just thinking, if oh, I was homeless. I thought homeless, you meant you took the quarters. If I was homeless, boy, I'd be at Aldi's all day. I'd get me all kind of uh, booze and whiskey, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yeah, I be getting drunk. Yeah, I got a bitch waiting to buy. She actually went and bought a new one about an hour ago. Bought me a bottle of J&B. Some J&B, you know? That's on buy some So after I'm now, finished isn't? doing this work here, I'm going to do me a little sipping. <laughs> <laughs> doing a little sipping. Okay, let me get this. about this wicked ass yeah so if you ain't got no money yeah there's all kind of ways to hustle some money up out yeah this. i got i got a bus pass i just need to get a couple cigarettes oh yeah a couple of some lucy's, lucy's. <laughs> <laughs> some lucy's i got some change bro yeah it's like it ain't much that's why that's all i got on me I have no idea. I don't smoke, man. Yeah, you still need to smoke, bro. It's gonna kill you. Damn. You look like you need a smoke. <laughs> yeah, you know, kind of stressful, ain't it? Stressful world. Right, right, right. You wanna know why? You wanna know the key essence to why? Because the Lord is punishing us. You know? Ain't nobody trying to hear that, though. No, I believe that. Yeah, the Lord's punishing us. We some, we some dumbasses. You know, we some fuck-ups, hard-headed, stubborn-ass kids. Yeah. He's a heavenly father, we're his children. we stubborn-ass, dumb-ass children that need their ass work. following the Old Testament. Well, that's what we, we out here doing. Old Testament, New yeah. Testament. Yeah, New like Testament he too. said, in, right, they, he, the Lord, uh, he jacked up the Israelites, didn't he? Oh, yeah. He, he, he called them. The Assyrians, the Babylonians, yeah. the Egyptians. He did it, yeah. The Romans. Yeah. Keep yeah. going, you got it, bro, you got it. You know a little something, something. He's still doing that to this very day. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's why we're not back in our homeland right now. That's why we got some the Jew rats over there in Israel now. They're not real. They're not Israelites. They've stolen our land. You want to okay? know something funny? You an Israelite. I know, because of the new, the new branch. What you mean? Well, because I've been baptized in Christ. Oh, no, nah, that ain't how you become an Israelite. You an Israelite through your dad's side, through your father's seed, man. And through your father's seed, your father. And back did, back in the day, he had sex with you know he was a black man. He had sex with a uh, 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 you know some black man had sex with a white woman and it just kept going. Ends up with you. <laughs> That's how you don't come. You can't go to some church and dump you in some fluoridated water. That, you know with shit and pisses that's all in. You know what I'm saying? Dunk you up under that shit and then pull you out and you're an instant Israelite. Yeah, because that branch you're talking about in that book of Romans. That's when that book of Romans, when they get grafted in, those are the Israelite foreigners who were scattered and they forgot that they was Israelites and they lost their heritage. So I got a scripture for you. Right. Right out the book of Romans. Because Paul, the book of Romans was written to the Israelites living in Rome. But they didn't know they was Israelites. Some of them might have known, but a lot of them did not know. And a lot of them don't know, didn't know they didn't look like the average, the ordinary Israelite, which was a black man. Oh, the Bible said, yeah. right. <laughs> but check this out. This is the. Uh, let me read the scripture for you real quick. This is Romans 11 and 25. Because we out here, we revealing mysteries to people. Okay. You know the Bible is a mysterious book, and you got a billion different people trying to break it down. Uh, Romans 11 and 25. For I would not, brethren, that ye should be ignorant of this mystery, lest Ye should be wise in your own conceits that blindness in part has happened to Israel. Hear that word though, he said mystery. That blindness in part has happened to Israel. Has happened to Israel until the fullness of the Gentiles come in. That's why we are here, we're bringing in those Gentiles. And so all Israel shall be saved. So all Israel cannot be saved until the fullness of those Gentiles come in. Because those Gentiles are actually Israelites. So this, this is why it says, blindness in the part has happened to Israel until 
the fullness of the Gentiles be come in, and so all Israel shall be saved. As it is written, there shall come out of Zion the deliverer, and shall turn away ungodliness from Jacob. So who's Jacob? That's Israel. That is Israel. That's it. See? That's our forefather. See the sign? Your name is biblical. See, that's a, that's a characteristic of an Israelite anyway. Been named after, been named after yep. biblical Bible names, you know? So that means your parents believed in the Bible. Did your parents believe in the Bible? Of course they did. You Benjamin. got a name like Benjamin? Benjamin? Yeah. That's a tribe. <laughs> and that's kind of funny, too, because spiritually, a lot of you white dudes are Benjamin. The tribe of Benjamin. That's some funny shit. <laughs> that's only spiritual, though. There's some spiritual shit going on here. Yeah, go and say you want to sell us this black joke. Oh, it's man. Jesus joke. Oh, I mean, I didn't know Jesus was black. He lived at home to me with Stern. Joseph wasn't as good as him. Yeah, it'd be a funny right. joke, but Joseph right. was his dad. Yeah, Joseph was his senior. Joseph busted a nut in Mary yep. and gave birth to the Lord. It was, that, that virgin birth shit, that got the, some angel come down. Get on, get on. Uh, what's that? Uh, 1 Corinthians 11. We talk about uh, flesh shall be changed. Yeah, that's a stumble block. The virgin birth is yeah. a stumble block. Yeah, I mean, the, uh, 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 a spiritual angel. I mean, don't have no need for sex. And don't shoot nothing. Don't shoot like we do. In Luke, it says that she was impregnated by the Holy Spirit. Right, and right. They said, but no, what it said, that's not what it said. It said he was filled with the Holy Spirit from the womb. Thank you. And it also said John the Baptist was filled with the Holy Spirit from the womb. Okay, Elizabeth wasn't a virgin. It said in the same, very same chapter. We can read it. But I mean, a lot of people believe in a virgin birth. But the scriptures he uh, tell you that Joseph was his father. That's why you read Matthew one. It has a genealogy. He has a genealogy going back to King David, going back to Abraham. You know what I'm saying? For him to be king of uh, Israel, he had to come from the line of Judah, from the uh, seed of David. What is it? We got it. Listen to this one. Listen to this one. First Corinthians 15 and uh, 35. But soon man will say, How are the dead raised up? With, with what body do they come? <clears throat> thou food, that which thou sowest is not quickness, except it die. And that which thou sowest, thou sowest not that body that shall be to bear grain. It may change of wheat or some other grain. But God giveth it a body as it hath pleased him, and to every seed his own body. All to every seed. To every seed, its own body. Right. Seed being a sperm comes from a Greek word sperma, which means seed. Same, all the same thing. All flesh is not the same flesh. All flesh is not the same flesh. But there is one kind of flesh of men, other flesh of bird, and beast, and other uh, fishes, and other birds. There are celestial bodies. Listen, listen to that. Read that again. There are celestial, celestial bodies. There are celestial bodies. And terrestrial. And terrestrial. So there's a distinct between there's two different bodies right there. No, no. Celestial. Well, like an angel. You're kind of right. But those angels, that's a celestial body. So when we inherit the kingdom back, all of Israel is going to have celestial bodies. Right. Because the Lord, had, when the Lord was on the earth, he was like us. He, he, he you know, he died. Mm -hmm. But he rose from the dead, but he died. He had a terrestrial body. That's right. Here. Even I'll though he had power. And let me bring a scripture out for you real quick. I already got it. That's good. Check this out. Acts 2 and 29. Men and brethren, let me freely speak unto you of the patriarch David, that he is both dead and buried, and his sepulchre is with us unto this day. Therefore, being a prophet, and knowing that God had sworn an oath to him, that the fruit of his loins, according to the flesh, <laughs> he would raise up Christ to sit on his throne. So that, that, that's, plain, that's plain and clear, that virgin birth. He come from the fruit of David's loins. <laughs> that's right. The fruit, what's the fruit of your loins? You know, it wouldn't be vulgar, it's just that's the only way, you know, you can only, you can reach these people out here, you gotta speak their type of language, you know, that, that what's the fruit of his loins? Busting a nut, you know? He pretty much said he's <laughs> from David's balls. <laughs> I mean, to speak Paul well, Right, right. You know that's I mean? the only way you can reach these people. You got to speak what they understand. And that's pretty much what Paul did. Right that's there. right. That's right. You know I mean? That's right. You know. 
I always like that scripture too. I mean, that one, that's cut and dry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just like this Romans 1 and 3. Check this out. Romans 1 and 3. The divergent birth is, really, this is a small matter. This is not even of any importance. Really, I mean, we got to destroy that lie, but there's a lot more important Cast stuff. Cast it down a stronghold. More important stuff to talk about. But uh, Romans 1 and 3. Concerning his son, Jesus Christ, our Lord, which was made of the seed of David, according to the flesh. Damn. Damn. That's clear, too. Damn. Mm, mm, mm. You know what I mean? Of the seed of David. Of this, and in Greek it says sperma. Of the sperma of David. That's why these people are such a mess, man. Because of these religious, the religious leaders, they led them all in all kind of crazy directions, but the right way, you know? These faggots and shit, you know? You ain't gay, are you? You know, what you, I mean, what you think about them homosexuals? Oh, yeah, you're right. But they got, uh, <laughs> you hear over in Ireland, they voting tomorrow in Ireland to legalize gay marriage. Oh. They trying to, that's why they pushing it worldwide. You got actual homosexual devil workers, devil workers running, running shit, you know what I mean? That's right. Running shit, really, running shit. That's why they constantly forcing this homosexual agenda on us. You've been downtown recently? When you go down Broad Street, they have homosexual flags flying all the way down Broad Street. You know what I'm saying? Let's see somebody put up a, a Bible flag. See what happens. There'll be outrage. Right. Ain't nobody never protested those nice restaurants they built down there that was built specifically just for fags nope. and lesbians. Ain't nobody never they said nothing it. about that shit. And now, go down there, the restaurants, there's a whole line of them, man. You walk in the motherfucker, you see motherfucking men kissing. You know? You don't want to go. Yeah, Women's yeah. finger. I'm, I'm fucking up in schoolies one day. I seen a woman finger their fair girlfriend, you know? She turned me on. That's some freaky shit, man. Yeah, that's some freaky shit. You just don't do that shit in the open. Come on, come on. Take it to your car or something, at least, you know? But I, it's just all out now, man. It's just all out. I met a girl. We go into the car. She's like, hold on. I ain't know the girl, man. She just sort of, um, she just started pissing right there in front of me, man. With no care. No care or nothing, man. Like it was some though. It's okay. That's because uh, Isaiah, okay. Isaiah three and nine, the show of their countenance doth witness against them. They declare their sin in Sodom. They hide it not. You just look at them. You just look at them. That motherfucker need to be put to death. Yep. Walking around, makeup on, dresses, uh, whatever, man. They just go all out. You know a fucking faggot when you see a damn homeless a Sodom. I like calling them Sodomites. They are Sodomites. Well, the Lord Sodomite. said that. He said they, they show their countenance doth witness against them. They declare they sin of Sodom, they hide it not. Right. Woe unto their soul, for they have rewarded evil unto right, themselves. That's right, woe unto their soul. You know what I mean? Because they have rewarded the dis death and destruction of themselves. That's what's coming, is death yeah. and destruction. He souls ambassador, <laughs> AKA Michelle Obama. <laughs> Who we at? Oh, I was gonna read that uh, Leviticus. You want it? Yeah, go ahead. Bring it Leviticus. Down. This is Leviticus 20 and 19, 13. If a man also lie with mankind, as he lieth with a woman, both of them have committed an abomination. They shall surely be put to death. Their blood shall be upon them. Yeah, yeah, that's plain and simple, but that don't happen in this country. Yeah. In this country, you're a homosexual. You're a protected class now. Shit, you, oh, yeah. you know what I mean? You're, you, yeah, got, you get a hate crime. If you, right, you get a mm -hmm. hate crime. Mm -hmm. That's right, that's right. That's how you know this. That's how you know the Lord's about to come, man. Because see, all this shit is coming out now. Everything's coming out the closet. He wants everything exposed before he destroys it. And plus, he got us out here Waking people uh, up. Right, right. Indicting the devil and uh, indicting two thirds. Right, because we bring an indictment. <laughs> indictment papers, <laughs> right. I know you've been indicted before, haven't you? How you feel when you're reading them red paper on red leaves? You know them, them indicted? I've, man, I've been indicted for shit I didn't even do, some man. bullshit. You know what I'm saying? They just, now, who the fuck are these people that, that are making these indictments? That, that so called grand jury. Who are these people in the grand jury? Nobody knows, but I know who they are. They're a bunch of fucking Jews. Oh yeah, he sitting just, back. The so yeah, the so-called Jews—they run this country. Damn right. They they control Hollywood. 
They print the money. I know you heard of the Federal Reserve, right? Who's that uh, controlled by? Who owns that? So-called Jews, they own all the banks. You can't even get your check cash from your job without going to, through a so-called Jew. You're right, bro. Hey, hey, check it out. You get a check, for example, you get a check for $500, $1,000. You go to the bank and get a cash. I mean, if the bank is, the check is legit coming from whoever, you know, a company or whoever, man. But they still hold that check for a few days. Make they sure won't let you get it. Because they looking at your shit. They making sure you ain't got no outstanding child support and or then, some yeah. shit, you know? And they're going to make sure you paid your taxes and everything else. And they'll take that whole check, bro. Yeah, they will. They will that's why, yeah, fuck a bank, man. But well, they control the world through usury. And usury, you know what usury is, right? Charging everybody high interest rates. You ain't supposed to charge people interest rates at all. That's how they control the whole world, is through usury. Get everybody in debt. They, oh, this whole country's in debt. You ever look at the debt clock? It's, a de <laughs> kind of, how, it's like $500 trillion in debt or something ridiculous. Last time I looked at it, was um, one of them was at $100 trillion. I don't even know. I know it's, it's, it's impossible to pay it back. You know what I mean? It's impossible to pay that debt back. A debt? Well, who is it owed to? It's owed to someone. A debt. It ain't that debt is just not owed to some thin air. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, because yeah, cause like the, uh, it goes back to the so-called Jew. That debt clock, when you pull it up, man, it slows your computers down. He said it slows your computer down. Yeah, well, it does mine. <laughs> it slows everything down, man. <laughs> it moves so fast. It, it does. It does, man. I know, it's every time I pull it up on my computer at home, it slows that motherfucker down. I ain't never pulled it up on this. Why you get it? I'm gonna read this scripture. Revelation 2 and 9. I know that works and tribulation and poverty. See, we're all in poverty. We ain't got no money. Like he's saying, if you get a little check or something, the government will take it. The bank won't let you get your money out the bank. Now, let's say you got a few thousand dollars in the bank. Go try to take it all out. Take it all out at once. It will not let you. That's not your money. I know that works in tribulation and poverty, but thou art rich. And I know the blasphemy of them which say they are Jews and are not, but are the synagogue of Satan. Oh, check, check this sign out, bro. I did thieves. Read this. But that sign right there tells you everything you need to know. Here. They control this whole country. Shit, they control the world. You ever hear of the New World Order? It's the Jew World Order. And they're not even real Jews, they're Edomites. You know, you ever hear of Esau? Yeah. They, they come from the house of Esau. And they know that too. Oh, look, check this out. Let me read this right here. So it's time, but it ain't coming up. It's all good. We ain't got to worry about it. You tell them to Google it. Google the debt clock. Well, check this out. Hey, get this on camera. You see that? I'm going to read it for the camera. It says, Edom is modern Jewry. That's from the Jewish Encyclopedia. That's the Jews' own writing. It says, strictly speaking, it is incorrect to call an ancient Israelite a Jew or to call a contemporary Jew an Israelite or a Hebrew. It never but they admit in their own stuff. books today from Esau. As long as these stupid motherfuckers out here spinning these FRNs, these Federal Reserve notes, it's going to continue to go on. Yeah, shit. I that's didn't know all where that is. These people spinning. Probably it, Eddie George. It's the interest that they have to pay. So th these people ain't going to stop spending. Why they make uh, like a certain product like, uh, like higher? Like raise, uh, uh, raise the price or something? Interest. Yeah. The in that's usury. Yeah. That's usury. Yeah. It's amazing, man. I was just reading some usury laws in the Leviticus. Where was that at? I know the one in Deuteronomy. There's one in Leviticus, too, though. I'll just look it up. I like bringing out different ones. That's a fat-ass goal, man. He looked happy as can be. <laughs> you got him some pink headphones in. Oh, my. Those are beat by Dre's too, so. Oh, he was gonna get the hell out of here, son. Yeah, he couldn't, it was too much. Yeah. 
He looked like he was fucked up or something. He probably high on some shit or something. Like a trick to go. Oh, somebody gonna be by here running, running all the time. Here we go. Proverbs 28 and 8. He that by usury and unjust gain increaseth his substance, he shall gather for him that will pity the poor. I just, I just did a search on the word usury. You know what I'm saying? I know a lot of shit coming up too. Yeah, a lot of scriptures. A lot. United States deck clock. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, this one's changing. It's changing, but it ain't changing. Like this uh, Leviticus 25 and 36. Take thou no usury. Uh, actually, let me just get the Bible. 25 and 30. They can't pay that back. It's impossible. It's impossible to pay that back. United States. Look, that's the United States national debt per person. You owe 56000 that's some you. That's yeah. what you. What did I say? Yeah, because of the usury. The what, you spend, what you do to get that? Get that on camera. Get that on camera. <laughs> yeah, you can't see it though. You can't see uh, it. Just pull up the U.S. debt clock live. But what do you say time. for each fan? Each person in America owes what? Fifty-six thousand five hundred and fifty-four dollars and eighty-nine cent right now. So each person, even children, owe that much money. <laughs> but whom is it owed to? That's the question. Like he said, it's not owed to some magical. Thing right, in the air. Some, right, right, right. This is this is household. United States national debt per household is one hundred forty-six thousand four hundred fifty-three dollars and eighty-seven cents. And they do that to take advantage God. of people. Just check out what the scripture says about usury. Ooh. Leviticus twenty-five and thirty-five. And if thy brother be waxing poor, like all of us, right? If thy brother be waxing poor and fallen in decay with thee. Then thou shalt relieve him, yea, though he be a stranger or sojourner, that he may live with thee. Show him some love. Show brother right. some love. You know what I'm saying? Give him some money. You can't pay that back. Show that man some love. Give him a chance to, give him, you know. Yeah. Got to be in debt. That debt. It That's said, take thou no usury of him or increase, but fear thy God that thy brother may live with thee. Thou shalt not give him thy money upon usury, nor lend him thy victuals for an increase. That's fucked up too. Right? That's how people, they take advantage of you when you're poor. That's why they got all these check casher stores Woo. set up. You know the Jews own all that shit. Woo. All these check casher stores. All in the hood. All, yeah, all in the hood. All in the hood. Pawn shops. Uh, you name it, man. All Banks. All in the hood. If you want to buy a house, if you want to buy a house, you got to go through a so-called Jew. You got to go to the bank. And all you got all these people bragging. I own my own house. Oh, you don't own shit. A so-called Jew owns your house. You ain't never gonna pay that shit off. They got loans. They paying off goddamn loans for fifty damn years. <laughs> you gonna tell me we take fifty years? Yeah, yeah. To you get a house? A, yeah, you sign a. Um, you uh, can build a house out of fucking mud bricks faster than that. Right. Uh, Thirty-year fixed mortgage. Most 30. niggas don't know to get a fixed interest rate, but. A lot of them get that 30 year mortgage loan. You know, that's crazy, man. And in the first five years, you're paying on the interest. First five, 10 years, you're paying on the interest before you even start paying on the house. <laughs> Shit. Plus, then what about the car? Your vehicle? Same thing. Everybody brags about their new car. I got a new car. <laughs> this is, they'd be like, this is my car. Like, that is not your car. Unless you got your shit off Craigslist for $500. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's not yours. Oh, wow. Shit. She got them big ass payments, man. How much people they you're a slave to all these payments. And you're in, you know, everybody's in debt. You take out these loans and you gotta pay these loans back. And interest on the car. Man. You I become see. a debt slave. We're all debt slaves. And like he said, whether you have a house or not, each person in America still owes like fifty six thousand mm. dollars mm. per person. You cannot make that shit up. Because people are, are, are a commodity on the stock exchange. What do you think a social security is all about and a birth certificate? Your property, your number, your cattle. It's like you, you, you tag your cattle, don't you? Yep. Don't you brand your cattle? Yep, yep. If you got cattle, you got a market. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, right. He saw slaves that he marked his, he branded his slaves too. Yep. And soon they gonna market even further with that microchip. Ooh. They gonna make sure your ass is marked. Market the beast. Oh, because earlier we told you America's the beast, so soon the beast is going to mark you. Y'all know about the mark of the beast? I'm going to get your chip? You'll get your microchip? 
No, but you guys should like, you should try out a science class. Science classes are cool and they like, they teach you uh, that all that's a load of shit. Well, we're not here teaching you. Science, what are you talking about science? I have no idea. If you were teaching anybody anything, you'd be a college professor. You'd be a college so professor. Teach you can't teach you shit from Cincinnati University. What's that? You can't teach you shit from Cincinnati University. Uh, no. So we can't teach you nothing. Uh, this? No, you can't teach us this. Yeah. We can't, we can't. So, let me ask you a question. Well, Who, who's the great? That's true. Hey, hey, that's true. hey, Esau, come here. It's who's the greatest time. scientist of all time? Who's the greatest scientist? Yeah. Uh, there's no greatest, but I mean, who, who's opinion, the greatest? Newton, Einstein. Who's the credit? Who? Who? Newton. Newton was a so-called Christian. Isaac Newton. He believed in the Bible. Right, but so that, he would. He would have called you a dumbass. No, that's not true. That's because true. He would actually. You know what? You know what Newton said. But he said he, the atheists are odious. I, odious. <laughs> that means you have a foul smell, a foul that. spirit. No, no, that's not. Yeah, that is true. No, Look it up. Google true. it, bro. That's, that's true. Google. Right, but, um, hey, what did he say? But, hey, just, just Google Newton, Newton atheist, odious. Okay, gotcha. It'll pop right up. Um, so you don't so, know so the about. market, like you literally think demons are running around. You think that's a good idea? Like that makes sense. It doesn't matter what I think. Well, yeah, it does. You're trying to. The only thing that matters is what's true and what's not true. So, right. Well, you think it's true? Isaac that Newton are actually around. wrote, "Opposition to godliness is atheism in profession and idolatry in practice." There you go. No. That's Google what I told you to Google. Okay. That's like Isaac Newton. Well, well, Isaac Newton. Okay. Well, hold on, wait, wait. It, the, on the only Bible. reason why I think he's so great is because he he invented calculus basically on a dare that he couldn't uh, define the the uh, ellipse of Saturn. But that doesn't mean that he was right on all opinions. It doesn't. Let me ask you now. You know who, well, you know who well, Nikola Tesla is? Oh yeah. uh, yes, I do. Well, so who's Nikola Tesla? A, he invented right, probably the more 20th than century. Every, he What's invented that? the 20th century. Yeah, Without him, you'd yes. have no electricity. That's very you'd true. You'd have no Wi-Fi. Well, he would literally he be have alternating current. You wouldn't have Wi-Fi. He invented the radio yes. signal. Yes, what's your point? He didn't well, he believed in God. Signal. Well, that's fine. That, okay, he that said, doesn't make any of this true. He, he said he received all his knowledge so through this, visions so, and dreams. So this never happened? What's this that? never happened? Yeah, that never happened? What, what did the slavery. This, this never happened. Oh, of course, slavery. You just said none of this is true. Oh, I mean, I was, okay, Mark. That's not in existence. Mark of the Beast? The you chip, don't tell me microchip. microchips are not the microchip. true. They're no. not real? Do you know, do you know the CEO? Where the fuck you been? Wait, listen. You think you have a microchip? Wait a where have you been? Uh, I've been in science What's class. that? Let me ask you a question. The do you know the Mixel Picks. Wait, what? What's that? Mixel Picks. Hey, you're Mr. Mixel Picks. Do you know... Listen, the CEO of PayPal said that he wants people to have microchips in their brains to pay for... Pay okay. with PayPal. Okay. So you, so you I, know PayPal. I know you're trying to get that shit out of But yeah. so you're trying to move the door that's going to the microchip. Yeah, I don't Okay, then you just said you just said this shit wasn't real. You're uneducated. Now you, dog, now you just said your dog got a chip. Yeah, yeah. do you know what the chip in my dog is? The microchip in my dog, it's got. That's the same thing they're going to put in you. Oh, wait, who? What? It, so they can identify so you them your, You gonna get your mom? Why not? You already got them. It has, my, like, it has right my dog's wait. name, and it has my dog. So your dog got a chip in it just for his name? name? Yes. So so you can find it if wait, it's man. lost. Oh, oh, so yeah. you no. they gonna scan the dog? Oh, his name is yes. his name is Timmy. Le no, what the fuck? No, it gives you your address and where it's at. So if the dog gets lost and they turn it into a shelter, they can scan. That's why they're gonna chip children. Your motherfuckers belong in America. <laughs> You're gone. Y'all belong here. You're gone. In America? <laughs> yeah, y'all belong here. Hey, hey. Oh, what's Hold up. You, you should, I mean, there's a lot with, uh, wrong with America, but You not should for, hate America. Uh, well, uh, in some senses I do, it. but not for this, these reasons. America, just the black people. Like, give me one reason why you think that's true. Just Let's just talk about the Bible. People. Give me one just reason you think it's true. <laughs> because it warned me of dumbass people like you. <laughs> it warned, it said there will be dumb people. Yes. And, mm. and and Hold wait, that, pro that. that proves that Jesus was born of a virgin. I, yeah, I never said really he was born of a virgin. Either. Well, wait, well, he well, was not Bible born does. of a virgin. The he was not. The Bible says that. Joseph, that's no, it does not. So, what scripture? Wait, what? Where, where at? What scripture? Well, says? I read the Bible front to cover, so and you don't know. A word. You know wait, wait, you don't think Jesus was born of a virgin? For the Virgin Mary, virgins right. don't give birth. Are you retarded? How can a virgin? That's what. Yeah. Well, no. That's what I'm understanding, but that's in your Bible. That's the spirit, it says man. the Virgin That's Mary. Man. I love the Where spirit, is it? Like what's it? In, in the Bible? What scripture? Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. Oh, Anyone? And the so Book of Matthew. Virgin 
have a baby and didn't get popped or nothing. She no, just, it just. No, stood. that's not what I'm saying. That's what you're saying. The book of Matthew. Saying. No, but, our book don't say that. Well, I thought it was the Bible. The Bible, Bible does not say that. Wait, what? Have you ever read the books, Matthew? Yeah, <laughs> yeah let's read Matthew. He has yeah. a genealogy. You know what a genealogy is? <laughs> yeah. What's a genealogy? Hey, it, it says Joseph is his father. Okay. It says he descends from David. Don't talk condescending to me. You're the one out here with these. Oh, yeah, sorry. You're the one that said Mary fact, was a bird. No, I can actually tell you how many. Uh, it, what was it? 48 uh, people are. The genealogy is 48 in in the book of Luke and 28 in the book of uh, uh, Matthew, I believe. Oh. In, in terms of how far back it goes to David, yes, they, they list the names. Listen, let me read. So wait, you don't think the Bible says uh, the genealogy, that Listen. Mary was a virgin? You don't think that? Well, let me read something for you. Listen to this. Yeah, you, you used to so Michelangelo, or not Michelangelo, the, the archangel, uh, 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 what was his name? Gabriel. Gabriel, there you go. He impregnated no, Mary. Oh. That's what the Bible says. It does not say that. Let, let me read this. Let me read this. Where are you going? Where are you going? Hold on, look. You were afraid to get proven wrong. Right, that's all you know. You know, you've, you've literally all never all read that book. I'm about to read it. I'm about to read it. Mary was a virgin. You out here, you ain't read the Bible. So what does the term virgin Mary come from? The Catholic Church. Which hey. gets it from the Bible? Have you ever read the Bible? Just let me fucking read this. Listen, why don't you learn something once in your slow life? Down, man. Yeah, slow down, man. Slow down. Slow down. That's the highest education any of you know. Acts 2. No, I doubt that. Acts 2 and 29. And men and brethren, listen, listen. <laughs> men and brethren, let me freely speak unto you of the patriarch David, that he is both dead and buried, and his sepulchre is with us unto this day. Therefore, being a prophet, and knowing that God has sworn an oath to him that of the fruit of his loins, <laughs> of the fruit of his loins, according to the flesh, he would raise up Christ. What's the fruit of his loins? 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 He's just being a being decency got this a this a faggot ass society. And thinking like a homosexual, you can't think of oh, 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 it, 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 it's, it's wrong to be born gay. Man, deal, man, come on. Alright, You're not born for No, listen, gay. wait, That's wait, time out, time out, time out. You made to no. be gay, to be a white side of mine. That's a choice you made. Uh, but then again, do you, they do you, got what? shit they put in the food, the water, it's and it the does help that. Food. It does help that alone. Wait, where do you get what, what that? What soy, you know what soy is? Genetically modified soy is in almost everything now. You, if you buy salad yeah, dressing, it has GMO soy in it, no, which soy. has high did, levels did, of estrogen. Did, did, you, you, did, you, did you know? You that, did you know that what every does soy do? What does soy do? What does soy do? What does soy do? It, it, it's what a nutrient. It has estrogen. What does it do to the male body? Estrogen. Do the male body? estrogen. Do you know what estrogen is? Yes, you talking about you're a science major. You don't know none of this. Wait. You literally have Mental no... Mental midgets. Wait, hold on. <laughs> you, you you just told me that the Bible doesn't say that Jesus was born of a virgin. I just proved it to you. That's the Old Testament. No, that's Jesus, the Acts. Jesus was born. I read yes, that's the Old the Testament. Of Acts. <laughs> yes, that's... that's the, Acts is the Old Testament. Testament. You're a... F Acts is the Old Testament. You're literally... Acts is the Old Testament. I'm retarded, but Acts is the Old Testament. Jesus is born say, say proper, of man. a virgin. The word virgin in Hebrew is I'm a virgin, young woman. The Bible, Bible verse. Here, I'll give you the verse. Do you May, want it? What age? Of what Ma age? Matthew 1 18. Look at Matthew 1 18. 1 18. Eat your words. Eat your fucking words. Pops. Go ahead. It says Matthew 1 18. Go. But you said no. Matthew 1 18. Before we do, I'll Matthew do that. I'll do that. But first, you gotta, you gotta uh, correct your statement. You said. The book of Acts is the Old Testament. Uh, but then uh, you, um, perhaps I was wrong there. Look at that. So, so you admit that you was wrong. Okay, sure, sure. So that means I'm right irrelevant. and you're wrong. Not and on, on, on a very small uh, column. Yeah, no, that's not small. That that's very, that's, that's irrelevant. Small. Matthew 118. Go eat your Let's say, yeah, come on, read Matthew 18. Matthew 118. Go ahead. Can I read it? Read it. You read it. Go ahead. Go ahead. Just like Esau. We are going to butt plug each other. He's going to cut himself. He's going to cut himself. Now the birth of Jesus Christ was on this watch. When as his mother Mary was expounded to Joseph. Espoused. What does the word espoused mean? Mary. Mary. What's the biblical definition of marriage? Sex. When the, the, what? The, the, well, Jesus said himself, when a man it says, of it says, marriage is It says, sex. wait, but, but before they came together, which means sex, she was found to be pregnant no. through the Holy Spirit. Before that. There you go. It said that was espoused. 
They all, well, that's that's just King a translation. You do, you do King something. James is translate. They all say the same thing. This is so. A, do you believe in God or do you believe in King wait, James? Wait, wait. Before before the marriage took place, while she was still a virgin, she became pregnant through the Holy Spirit. No. You literally, you don't even know your own crazy. Don't book. you know when Mary, when Joseph popped Mary, right? He had to put her away. They didn't read go, your you own know, book. They didn't read go your own the, fucking the book. Shit that they Matthew 1, 18 to 25. Listen, and anybody. Jacob begot Joseph, the husband of Mary, who was born Jesus. They about go fuck each other in the ass. They don't know what the fuck they talk about. Shut up, faggot. He can't understand it, man. Well, well he admitted that I was right and he was wrong. Some shit like that. People are crazy. He man. said the book of Acts was in the Old Testament. Mm -hmm. So who the hell? Come on, it was a joke. This is like, Old he, he's not the one to be talking about the Bible. If you say the book of Acts is in the Old Testament, your opinion is invalid. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> he said the book of Acts. That was, he said that's he the book. Said Acts is I ain't never heard nobody say something that stupid. We got referees walking around. Oh, Lord. <laughs> oh, he works at home. Oh, they make him wear that shit. Where's your whistle at, buddy? Oh, he's like, don't touch the whistle. Yeah, he's going to at the shoe store. That shoe store. Oh, Foot Locker or something? That's all it is. That's a sale. Oh, shoes yeah. I was, I was thinking, why the fuck are you wearing that? Who the hell would wear that, man? You boy trying to sell that bus pass all day. That shit gonna expire. <laughs> it's probably just a transfer, don't even work. <laughs> Dude works at Foot Locker and wearing some neon blue shoes. That's the new style these days. Everybody wears them bright ass colors. Shit gets freakier by the day. I don't even forgot what he's talking about after talking to those weirdos. He just kicked Let's just talk about your boy, uh, what we was watching today. That's funny, man. What's up, Esau? What's up? How you doing? Ready for slavery? <laughs> <laughs> Some creepy-ass people, man. And they got it going the fuck on, too. These creepy-ass people got it Oh, look, he, sell, he on, sold man. it. Oh, he sold that shit. I'm going to give him the thumbs up. Look over give him the thumbs up. All right. Yeah, he probably did. That dude's fucked up. He desolate, man. Yeah, well, he had desolate. What's that word? Desolate. Uh, he's in a low state. You know what I'm saying? He's brought to a low state. All of our people in a low state. You don't even know. The Lord said that, man. He bring us to a low state. He's a trash. Yeah, the dregs. Yeah, we drinking the dregs. That's what I, let's look, look at that. Ain't that at Lamentations? I'm gonna do a, a search on dregs. I bet there's some good ones we can skip on. Dreg, yeah, yeah. Probably is. We all out here drinking the dregs. You don't know what the dregs is. The dregs is like, uh, you know, when you get drinking, ain't the dregs like when you drinking some shit? I'm about to look it up in the dictionary. That bottom shit, is that it's bottom the, shit. The shit on the bottom. Mm -hmm. On the bottom drink, of the drink. You drink a 40 ounce. You, you don't drink the dregs. Right, that, that bubbly shit that looked like it got spit in everything. Yeah, floaters <laughs> in it. <Yeah. laughs> right, right. Somebody done spit some chewing tobacco in it. Mm, mm, mm. No, that's nasty. Find that dregs, Isaiah. Now he be finding scriptures quick. This boy be studying. Isaiah uh, 50, 51 and 20. Thy sons have fainted. They lie at the head of all the streets. That's it. That's one of them. As a wild bull in the net, they are full of the fury of Yahweh, the rebuke of that God. Here goes your homie. Therefore, hearing out this, thou afflicted and drunken. Thou afflicted and drunken. Uh, thou says, he thus says, thy Lord, thou, thy God, that put the cause of his people. Behold, I have taken out of thine hand the cup of trembling, even the dregs of the of the cup of my of my uh, fury. That's it. That's it. Right the dregs of the cup of the Lord's fury. 
being living out in this shit, that's part of the Lord's fury. That's right. Thou shalt no more drink it again, but I will put it into the hand of them that afflict thee. Yeah, we can, the Lord is going to put it in the hand of these shit. Edomites. He's going to flick this shit. He's going to flick Like we've been talking about the so called Jew all day. That's the chief house of Esau. they going to drink that dregs. The, the That's fuck, a creepy man. motherfucker right there. <laughs> he, what? That's a creepy motherfucker right there. You guys, you gotta get these creepy crawlers on camera. Right, man. That's some creepy. Yeah, you see the way he was walking? Yeah, yeah. You see his look. God damn. So he gonna be drinking that drink. Mm -hmm. Look how your dude's walking. Look, he got black shoes, green and red. Her pink. Blue. Ain't nothing matching. Literally, ain't a goddamn thing matching. It looks like he got his head. Look like he's gone. He, he got AIDS. He got, he got That's why I said hip. Oh, he got tuberculosis. He got that losis. Mm -hmm. Out here fucking I heard stands. that tuberculosis is uh, spreading. Oh, fuck yeah. That's some bad shit. Some about it. Be like a, I think I might have read it. Mutated too. So. Yeah, all this shit's mutated. Uh -huh. uh, they've been using so much uh, antibodies that it shit don't even work no more. They've got super bugs forming up in the hospital. Super bugs. You know what I mean? Because they all that medication and all the antibiotics they giving everybody, these viruses mutate and they, uh, you know what I mean? They change, they adapt to the viruses because them viruses are alive. They're alive creatures. They don't want to die. They want to live. <laughs> so if they want to live. They gotta mutate and adapt. You damn know what I'm right. saying? You're damn right. So that's what mutate. they do. That's why. Go. That's why the most dangerous place to go to is the hospital. Oh, I seen your boy post something. Like, this, this dude, uh, uh, he posted something on the internet on a uh, on a site. He was at the hospital. And he was at the hospital wearing plastic gloves and a face mask. Your friend, your you friend? Yeah. He uh, said he don't trust them fucking hospitals. He, was, he, he said he wanted his whole room sanitized, all kinds of shit. I don't blame him. I don't blame him. Yeah. 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 Oh yeah, you know I got this bitch that worked in hospitals too, and she said this bitch had a. a uh, this was just yesterday. Her friend had, a, um, a, a, had an abortion. The doctors ripped her pussy up an accident. Oh, shit. And now she's in intensive care. They, they, she can't stop bleeding. <laughs> she won't stop bleeding. And they was, that's what they, your boy Alex Jones was talking about today. Mm -hmm. yep. we, this just happened yesterday. We was watching the Alex Jones today having a good time. I didn't why I listened to it. He got to watch it. But they down there protesting the abortion clinic. Black and, Lives Matter. Yeah, they, with a hashtag, Black Lives Matter. And they, <laughs> and they was trying to tell those women that, because people... Uh, they was trying to tell the women that abortions are dangerous. You, yep. you, you can get hurt, it can kill you, it causes breast cancer, all kind of shit. Yeah, it fucks you up. That's it punishment up. from the Lord for doing that to yourself. Yeah. Yeah, that's an unnatural thing you're doing. It causes their titties to sag even more, too. Yeah. Them titties just come flat and flat and flat, can't hold no firmness, man. No firmness. Plus, they be leaving pieces of the baby inside Ooh. the body. <laughs> yeah, they just get in there and just chop it up, man, like a serial killer. Just get up and you chop, chop, chop. So they were serial killers. They're serial killers. Both the bitch that laid in over her legs and the motherfucking doctor just performing the procedure. Yep. They, yeah, uh, uh, abortion doctors are they literally. Know Margaret Thatcher is. What's her name? That's, that's their queen. Mar yeah, Margaret Thatcher. She's the. What's the hero? Yeah, I was watching the Alice Jones or listening to it. And I didn't even know that they had pictures of Margaret Thatcher with the KKK. Yeah, they was bringing it up, too. He actually, Alex, he didn't put the one with the KKK up. Oh, but somebody had it, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I heard him talking about it. Right. They might have, though. And I then they remember. had the communists come out. Y'all got to go watch it on Alex Jones' channel. I'm, it's it, hot today. It's hot. Yeah, it's that hot shit was hot, man. It's hot on it Alex hot. today. But they had the communists coming out with black cloths and black signs trying to cover their signs up so people didn't get that information. You can't make that shit up, man. They had actual communists. A lot of them were so-called black people, too. They had communists. They, they was the same communists was down there in Ferguson. The same communists was in Baltimore. They was even up in Cleveland. They going around everywhere trying to stir up the pot. And now they in Texas. Texas, Baltimore. That man, they all over. Where they get their money from, man? The communist party. Right, right. George Soros. They told you George Soros and a so-called so Jew. Hey, there goes your homie, the he, he, she. He donated him like $30 million to the Ferguson and all the riots and shit. What? Damn. That's so, nothing. Oh, that's nothing yeah, to him, that's right? Nothing, well, he can just print it up. Yeah, that's nothing. He can print whatever he wants up. He just get his boys on the phone. He get the little, the little Jew brothers on the phone and print him up some money. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, but the communists was down there. They had their signs uh, giving all the statistics of 
how many black children have been murdered by uh by abortion yeah. and they was trying to cover their signs up they didn't want that information to get out right right they even off on the on the answer what's up huh? what's up <laughs> yeah because they said uh, abortion is the number yeah <laughs> I can run with you when we done here you want a party <laughs> <laughs> that's see that's what you, that's how you do a woman you you see, did he hit her with any scriptures? Right. No. You know what I'm saying? That's right. Are you wasting your time trying to teach a woman? So look, dude, Come on, dude. let's go. Let's see, dude. <laughs> That's my homie. Oh, he got the injury. Well, what I was about to say, that distracted me. Uh, oh, yeah, the, the, the most dangerous place for a black child is in the black woman's womb. Right between the black woman's legs. So once they have between the black woman's legs, the most dangerous place. That and really, that's the most dangerous place for any child now. Tissue lovers. You know what I mean? They're yeah, right, between any woman's legs. So now, woman legs. They're making abortions trendy. Yeah, oh. Yeah. Oh, they ain't Pokemon book, I guess. That's a fact. That's our That's our Like a uh, uh, Superman. The, the, man, the man over there. Oh, the fat boy George. Yeah, the fat boy George. <laughs> Oh uh, shit, that's Culture Club. Oh shit. They, they got their Culture Club music playing while they walk. See, them walking, them motherfuckers walking in because they fucking. That's why. That's because they fucking. Uh, scary, man. We live in the fucking Twilight Zone. Who's he, Latino? Probably so. You hear that Twilight music playing? That doo 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 doo. <laughs> Who the fuck, man? They get, oh, don't get those freaks on camera. Yeah, he's, they beating it up, man. That's why they win. Yeah, they about to go tag team that shit. <sighs> Some weirdos. Eat each other's ass. Yeah, so that thing's leading the way, too. That's right. That's right. But yeah, you don't get them on camera. They notice. They come over and they want to get attention. <sighs> yeah, I fucked the train and thought of. Oh, yeah, but we was watching the... Uh, <laughs> we was watching the Alex Jones Pro. I know everybody done seen it by now. That dude, the old leader from the Texas GMS camp, was down there. You know who? Did you, you watch this? Uh, he, 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 he probably he don't even know who he is. Yeah, he don't know who he is. He just came in. He was down there trying to team up with Alex Jones or something. He fell out what? In the beginning of last year? Yeah. They, yeah. Bugged out. But the dude, I guess his name is Element. Didn't you say he was down there saying he was trying to fight for free speech? He was fighting. He was, yeah, he was actually fighting. Yo, look at the video of the Alex Jones today. Dude, the Dallas camp, the old leader, he was actually handcuffed to handcuffed with motherfuckers. I didn't hear him come out with no scriptures. I saw him holding, he, I saw him locked up like professional wrestling with some dude, man. That's why I got him a text I was message. I up, man. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 you just woke me up too, man. I woke up, man. I, I went know, straight a, to that. That sounds good to wake up to. Yeah, I, I, that's yeah, a I, nice I, little surprise. Yeah, it put me in the spirit too. I can't wait to get home tonight and watch <laughs> the videos. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I can't wait to see you. You know, all the GMS brothers are going to have fun with that. They don't want it. But your dude was out there. I, I didn't get it here at all because my Wi-Fi was going in and out. Because I heard him say with his own mouth, I'm here to fight for free speech. And I, ain't, I ain't really hear him talking about, uh, I ain't hear him bring out no scriptures or nothing. He, he was coming out with his own crazy belief system. That's what happened. Yeah, he's, like I told, I sent my brother a text. I was like, dude got demoted. He got demoted to just a protester. <laughs> First, he's out there claiming to be a prophet. Now he, now he demoted. He's just a protester. That's sad, man. That's a sad state to be in. And he's just a, he's out there being an egomaniac, trying to get famous, trying to get hired on by Info Wars. I ain't gonna hire you, man. Oh, well, I could be wrong. What we wake up tomorrow? You got a job with Info Wars? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Wouldn't that be some shit? <laughs> that would be funny, though, man. Hey man, do what you gotta do. Yeah, <laughs> you're right. Cause yeah, I man, you can't. Hey, the truth is, doing this work right here ain't for everybody. You know what I mean? Sure. Is. But yeah, that was just a good time, man. We're listening to Alex Jones today. And it's a, today too, just like uh, a lot of those people down at abortion clinic, the pro, the pro-choice people. They started saying, hell Satan, hell Satan. Did you yeah, hear that? Yeah, yeah, Just like yeah. that, there was a protest, what, a couple years ago, where all, all the pro-choice people, the pro-abortion people, they got together with a big loud chant and they all going, hell Satan. Because there's Christians out there protesting it. So all the abortion people just started cheering real loud, hell Satan. That's mad. Hell, when people, 
They don't want, we got actual devil worshipers running shit out here, man. Actual Satanists, people who worship Satan running this country, okay? Actual devil worshiping faggots run this country, okay? That's why when you go downtown in front of City Hall, they got homosexual rainbow flags flown all the way down the street, authorized by the mayor, you know what I'm saying? What's that? Oh, check this out. That's the, you can't get on that on camera, can you? It's blurred. It's probably hard to see. I can see the trees Robert better Thatcher. than that. It's Margaret Thatcher, the, well, she's the, the founder of Planned Parenthood, which is on every street corner in the hood. <laughs> She, she was taking, got, they got a picture of her with the KKK. Good job, Margaret Thatcher. And like I said, abortion, that's the number one uh, murderer of black people. The so-called black people. The abortion. She knew what she was doing. She's probably a so-called Jew, too. But yeah, but we have a, if we call, tell people abortion is evil and murder, they'll call us misogynists. They'll say, you're a misogynist. You hate women. You know what I'm saying? We, we say we hate women because we don't want to murder. Right. Don't that make no sense. Don't want to kill the we don't we don't murder and chop up babies, so that makes us uh, misogynists and hypocrites to call us because we don't chop babies up and yell hail Satan. Got your Lucy's? Yeah. <laughs> Told you somebody would buy that bus pass. Told you. Yeah. Just stay right here in this spot, man. I still got one more. One more bus pass. <laughs> <laughs> you got the hook up. Oh, uh, he probably, you can go to the treatment centers, I bet they pass out bus pass. You go to court, they give you a bus pass. That's probably a place give it, go to the church. Or, or the hospital, pass. they'll give you a bus pass. Go to the clinic, they give you a bus pass. Oh, go to the, go to the go clinic, to boy. Because they make sure you got transportation to that clinic. Blood bank. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. the blood yeah. bank. But it's a Planned Parenthood right down the street from me, out there on the... Uh, Is it? Oh, no. On the out east, right, right, right there on Main right, Street. Right. Yeah, that's right. Right before you get on. There's one, one on there, West Broad. They, and and there's two on. There's two on Main. No, it's going no, yeah. What? No, there's one on. Yeah, West Broad. There's one on East Broad. I see. One day I was driving. Uh, I had my mom with me. We was in a rush going somewhere. But I seen this beautiful woman out there. She was hot, man. Right, 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 she was right, out there, right. had her own sign she made, and she was cursing them out. Right, I right. wanted to stop and talk to her, but I couldn't. I heard that, because there's one right around the corner from where I'm at. There's one right past camp, uh, campus. They're everywhere. Yeah, they're, they're everywhere, right. They're just chopping little babies yeah. up, man, just chopping them up. Because up where I'm at, there's usually a guy, and sometimes you may see two other women out there with this guy holding signs outside it. Outside, and they be having some graphic big ass posters that cost money to make, man. Look, I mean, they be having them big ass posters. Going man. In. They put our posters to shame. Big -ass the man. other planes be crossing right there. That's a biplane. Well, that's a low one, though. Yeah, that's lower. That's a biplane. Because they're usually a little higher than that. That's actually not a They only got one wing, actually. That's probably somebody, that's probably somebody's backyard plane. Yeah. Them planes is probably the people their own airplane. Because my wife uh, used to work with somebody live out in the country that have like six planes like that, man. Those are the they're planes only, that are always fucking up. I get Obadiah 18. So I got a scripture. Take off and everything. Esau got it going on, man. I got a scripture because uh, Esau want to exterminate us all with their eugenics programs. Because the abortion, that's all part of the eugenics program to exterminate Israel. But just like we read earlier, oh, where'd that scripture go? That one we read in Ezekiel, that's relevant to this. If I can find it, I lost it. Man, I can read this Margaret shit all day long, cause it ain't doing, this bitch was a racist hoe, man. I will re get that, let me read I'm this real a quick. Racist fucking devil. Therefore, man. as I live, saith the Lord God, I will prepare thee unto blood, mm. and blood shall pursue thee. That's right. Since thou hast hated blood, Never even hated. blood shall pursue thee. Never hated. Excuse Always me, I'm, said I said it wrong. Since thou hast not hated blood, since thou hast not hated That's blood, not. <laughs> even blood shall pursue thee. That's the key that I was looking for, that word, not. Yeah, not. <laughs> I was slipping my speech sometimes. You know what I right. mean? Fucking so son is lying to me yeah, off that you building. You can't see the camera, can you? Yeah, so, yeah, because everything in this country, it's a bloody city, just like, uh, what was that, uh, Habakkuk, woe to the bloody city. Yeah. It's a bloody city. You got chopping up little babies. Yeah, uh, yeah. Where's this from, man? Toledo. Toledo. Toledo, okay, okay. Up north. Check in Salvation Army. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah. right, bro. Oh, that's a good place. Oh, All right, bro. The Sally? 
That's where your boy John was at the Salvation Army. Yeah, I think uh, yeah, I know all actually, kinds of people up there. They actually help people. Some up in Toledo, man, I was reading it. I can't remember, man. They give you a job and all kinds of shit. Yeah, but some up in Toledo, they got them leaving out of Toledo. I can't remember why. They yeah. a lot of motherfuckers coming from up north coming down here. I know a bunch of I people from why. Toledo that are staying in this Sally. The Sa they why. call it the Sally. That's the hood, that's the hood name for it, the Sally. <laughs> Salvation Army. Hey, that, that's, man, I miss the Salvation Army, this uh, old store that used to be on Front Street. Yeah, that that yeah. was my favorite store right, ever, right, man. Right, right. Where you had to go up the steps to get to it. We went in there yeah, negotiating. It ain't there no more. Damn. They moved it all the way. It's bullshit. They ain't got shit in there now. Now it's all the way down on South High Street. Wow. I, that was my favorite store. Bro. I used to go up in there with they get carts full of shit. You get a Nintendo for two dollars. The red, white, and blue helicopter. Awesome. Oh yeah. I'm going to bring it out with you. You got a Marjorie Thatcher. Making an emergency landing. This bitch is a real demon right here. This Marjorie Sanger. Saint, Saint, uh, what was it saying? Thatcher. That, uh, what are, oh, that's that fucking prime minister. <laughs> hey, she's a devil worshiper she's too. She's a devil too. <laughs> right, Marjorie right. Singer. Yeah, basically, you get devil worshippers confused with each other. You know what I'm saying? This is one of the quotes she said. We should hire three or four colored ministers, preferably with social service backgrounds. <laughs> And with engaging personalities, the most, somebody influential, the most successful educational approach to the Negro is through a <laughs> religious appeal. Damn. She's, I mean, they, they, they getting down with it, man. They Margaret, know how to get to the people, man. She's talking Margaret about Martin Singer. Luther King. We don't want to, the word to go out that we want to exterminate Negro populations. There, I mean, that's plain speech. It's, she ain't speaking in parables or nothing. <laughs> straight out. She's straight out with it. You know what I'm saying? Margaret Singer. That Margaret, we been saying Margaret Thatcher for like a half hour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck it. We don't give a fuck. We still put the video up. That bitch up. down with it too. <laughs> she, yeah, she was down with it too. She down with it too. That bitch is, that, <laughs> They all part of the same family. The same, they all devil worshipers. I always, I always get them too mixed up, man. Margaret. Uh, and the minister is the man who can straighten out the ideal if it ever occurred to any of their more rebellious members. So they knew how, they knew what they were doing, man, back then. That's a long time ago when this bitch was stepping around. Page, um, where we at? Um, <laughs> um, About Margaret Thatcher. You know, Clarence Gamble, president of American Eugenics Research Association said, there is a great danger that we will fail because the Negroes think that they plan for extermination. Hence, let appear to let the color run, run it as we appear to let the South do the conference in Atlanta. Like, give a nigga a job, this fool don't know the real thing, you know? Right, they don't know the plan. Just like they take a woman and they be like, uh, if you want to get this government assistance, you can't have a man in the house. Yep, yep. They, yep. they try their best to keep the family separated, encourage abortions. You know, back in the day, they used to just straight up sterilize people and tell them. The court would actually rule in order the woman be sterilized. Yep, yep. They would say, you're an unfit mother. You're not allowed to have any more children. That You're forced to be sterilized. I watched a lot of videos on that. But now they do it in secret. No, they will sterilize women through vaccinations. They got, get on YouTube and type in Bill Gates vaccinations. That's all you gotta type in is Bill Gates vaccinations. And uh, videos of Bill Gates will pop up. Well, Bill Gates was saying that uh, what through vaccinations, they're gonna uh, help control and reduce the world's population. I heard that's his mom right here. Oh uh, yeah, I heard somebody say yeah, that. Yeah, I heard that's his mom. Who knows? Yeah, it's a weird ass world we live in. It's man. a weird world. That's like people say, uh, What's that, uh, that bitch is that Bush bitch, uh, George Bush's wife was, uh, Barbara Bush. Barbara, Barbara. It's, people say Alistair Crowley was her, uh, father. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and they do say that. Yeah, that's, that's a popular theory. Right. Like, you know, you don't know, man. This is a fucking crazy world. Yeah. Crazy. Bug the fuck out. Where's the, uh, Yeah, so they use those vaccinations as a, as a Trojan horse. The, uh, vaccinations... Some of that shit might actually work. But they, they're not trying to actually help you. You think the government wants to help you? <laughs> Fucking crazy. 
Those vaccinations are to sterilize you, to make you retarded, to straight up kill you. I seen there's a story in the news a couple weeks ago, a bunch of girls, or was it a bunch of women down in Mexico, they all got vaccinated for uh, what that cervical cancer shit or something. I forget what it was. You could Google it. Mexican vaccination dead or something like that It'll pop up. But every last person that took the vaccination dropped dead. You know what I'm saying? Check this out. She said, we should apply a stern and rigid policy of sterilization and segregation to that grade of population whose, whose prodigy is tainted. Oh, yeah. Sterilization and segregation. And wasn't she famous for saying... You can either accept segregation or sterilization. Mm. Yeah, that's her. Yeah. Um. Population, their choice of segregation or sterilization. Oh, that's it, right? That's, that's what you just that, said. After they kept saying that all day today. Right, right. So that's some serious truth they brought out. Yeah, birth control must lead to ultimately to a cleaner race. That's how they do it. Um, a woman's duty to look the whole world in the face with a go to hell look in her eyes to speak and act in defiance of convention. The most penetrating thinkers are coming to see that a quantitative factor as opposed to quantitative one is a primary importance in dealing with the great masses of humanity. Um, women of the working class, especially wage workers, should not have more than two children at most. You see that? That's, that's the that, that policy they had in China. Two child policy, now they got a one child policy. So soon, like, like he said, he's watching that uh, Alex Jones video, and they had fucking, the Communist Party was actually protesting the protesters. Because you got the Communist Party us stirring up shit in Ferguson and Baltimore all over the country, right? But the, China is communist, and in China, they got a one child policy, and they have forced abortions. They will, for if you get pregnant, they will force you to have an abortion. And soon, forced abortions, they're going to come here. If they have their way, they're going to bring forced abortions to America. Because they want you all dead. So in, the, in the eyes of the elite, you're just all useless eaters. You know what I'm saying? Of course, if India got that mandatory ultrasounds when a woman get pregnant to find out the woman's pregnant with a boy or girl, a girl. The girls are useless. snuff them out. Yep, snuff them out. And they do that in China. Yeah. yeah. They don't want uh, girls. That also proves, too, because there's more women on earth than men. Way. And a man is more valuable than a woman. Way, way, yeah, way more women. Way, shit. Cause King Solomon was not dealing with no adulterous bitches either. No, nah, all of his women he had, there yeah. was a thousand women. And yeah, he would have killed them. Yeah, yeah. None of them bitches was adults. They yeah. probably wanted to be, but they might. Yeah, he, no, I guarantee you, he had them on lock. Locked down. It's King, I guarantee you, King Song, he probably had a whole compound where he kept them. Right, right. Oh, that's funny about the Mad Max movie, because the women, the ones they had in the truck as slaves, as breeders, they had chastity belts on them, with oh, spikes on them. They had that shit with back in the day. spikes on them, yeah. During the, the, yep. the Dark Ages, These women... These had spikes on their stuff. They had spikes. You ain't getting up in that pussy. Bro. Right, right, right. You ain't getting up yeah. in there. That shit's on lock. On lockdown. Yeah, what does that tell you, though? You can't trust them. Yeah. Oh, the fight wake up. This is the Lord's duty in Lord's work. The bitch down there running her mouth. The only one you hear besides us, you hear her. Bitch all the way down the goddamn street. <laughs> it's loud as hell, man. Out of order. Damn, it's out quiet as fuck out here. This is the quietest I ever heard it. It is quiet, right? They, 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 you can't hear that bitch running her mouth. Out of order. Loud ass women. Uh, yeah, out of order. These women are out of order. It says the same woman is out of order. They call us evil because we was talking about that abortion shit. Right, right. They're like, y'all fucked up. Y'all ain't fucking right. You ain't men of the Lord. 
And here this woman done have, what, 20 abortions? Ooh. I mean, a lot of women, they have multiple abortions. Yeah, I've had a woman, women that had so many abortions, the doctor said you can't have no more. They probably got all <laughs> kind of baby parts left up in them. Yeah. Had so many abortions, they can't have more babies anyway. They just mess their whole they, body up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Miscarriage after miscarriage and when they finally want to get pregnant. Just think about that for a second. They have all these abortions, little pieces of babies all up inside of them. Then they got all these different men busting nuts up inside oh, of them. God, demon and story. It, it just all kind of different nuts fermenting up oh, inside their body. A pot of demon They just nuts. Because sperm battle, if you got two uh, different men's sperm inside a woman's body, they battle. It's a war. This is a proven scientific yeah. fact. They war, battle. World War III started there. Man, yeah, it's war, war III. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. That's the, they got sperm wars. I bet you could Google sperm wars. Uh, you huh. might find something on it. It's, it's been here. a while since I googled. I forget how I found it. Yeah, it's all over here. Sperm. Is. So yeah, because sperm has spirits in it. That's an actual spirit. Oh, he's bugged out. Oh, he's getting my camera. Oh, he's doing the twitch. There you go. Uh, <laughs> I thought he's doing the meth twitch or the yeah, was the like, happy dance. Well, check this out. Sperm is alive as a spirit. Each sperm cell is a spirit. We wouldn't be here if it wasn't for that that spirit that was in that sperm. Yeah. So just think when you got a woman that had sex with ten different men in the same week, and all those sperms coming in together fighting, and then on top of that, she done had ten abortions. Oh, I seen a story on Vice like last week. It said. Women rather be single now because they know they could get a variety of dick and they could get it anytime they want it. Exactly. Yep, yep. Then That's they so charge true. for it too. That's so true. That's so true. Because you got these Uncle Toms out here, you got these all these cap and saver hoes out here. They, they they love these adulterous women. I got most men actually tell you yeah. they like a horse woman. Yeah, yeah. They prefer yeah. a horse woman. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Well, what kind of madness is that? Madness. They prefer, they, they like it a whore. They like to do freaky shit. They like their food. They, they do what, it, they they like to eat the cream pies and all that. <laughs> That's popular, bro. Yes, it is. You yes, gotta come is. right out with it, I man. I know you, you ain't making none of that. They like to eat the cream pie. Yep. They do the threesomes. Yep. Bukkakis and all that. Yep. Yep. The truffle What they call the truffle what? Truffle butter. They eat the truffle butter. Maybe toss a salad. Maybe look at bitch. You got these dudes that look at dudes assholes. Fuck a dude in the ass and then go fuck a bitch at the same time. It's just some freak shit out here, man. Nasty shit. The America is way worse than Sodom and Gomorrah ever was. You can't. Nasty shit. I see they had that that film festival. You see that in the news? There's the news. What's that film festival? The Cannes Film Festival. That big. It was the top story on drugs. They had some new movie coming out. It's about uh, a young couple that's transsexual sex in it. They, they got it's a, like a, it's supposed to be an actual movie. They got all kind. They showed the ejaculations and everything. They showed trainees having sex, <laughs> and you had people at the film festival fighting each other to get a ticket because there was only so many tickets. And everybody wanted to see that freak shit. But they have actual fist fights breaking out over a trainee movie. Hot, that was the hot shit. That was the hot shit that was out. So these, these people, they, they lust after this weird shit, man. They lusting after wickedness. Thirst for it. Israel's lusting. Yeah, they thirst for it. There's other nations. Fuck them. Yeah, fuck Israel. Right. 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 Uh, this is uh, second Ezra's one in five. Go thy way and show my people their sinful deeds and their children their wickedness. Oh, that's what we're doing. Read that again. Go thy way and show my people their sinful deeds and their children their wickedness which they have done against me. Right, so that part of that wickedness is women chopping their babies up, getting abortions, Ooh. drinking all this nut, fucking a thousand dudes, dudes out here. Dudes fucking a job. Be being dudes. bisexuals, trisexuals, right. eating cream pies, mm. bitches fucking horses. Mm. Bitches getting bukkakis on. It's all over the internet. Oh my god. Hey, if you ever get on Pornhub? Eating nut that's going just to another man. Oh. oh. They love that shit, bro. Mm. And then they eat the bitch's asshole out. With nut up in the asshole. 
And that's nasty. We just gonna come out and say it. Hell, our channel gonna get deleted. <laughs> you know what I mean, that's what they're doing. Gotta tell her how it is. These Gotta people are filthy, it man. It's filth. Gotta tell her how it's, it is, it's man. It's filth. I'm not the one doing that shit. I would never do that. Damn yeah, right. That's filth. I ain't eat my own nutty. My own wife's pussy. Hell, Hell no. Shit. That's a nasty shit. That's nasty as fuck. That's nasty, man. That's fucking nasty, man. And those probably be the most popular videos, too, on the internet. Oh, fuck. They it. probably got millions of views. You get a check in the mail and shit. Yeah, they get, that's why they do it, too, because they, they get paid for it, don't they? Check. Yeah, some people do. Yeah, a lot. Some of them got the sense enough to go get paid. Yo, and they got those porn sites where I'm pretty sure they share ad revenue just like YouTube. Mm -hmm. yep. You know what I mean? Have to. They probably have to. The Apostle Paul worked and he made tents by the grace of God. I hope you fall out the truck. Biatch. So stupid. He tried to say Apostle Paul worked so like stupid. Like we don't thing. like we don't work or something. Right, right. Oh stupid motherfucker. We are working, dumbass! You know, that's funny though. I just don't forget him. I, I, I just made a video about this very topic yesterday. Put up on the alternate channel. <laughs> Cause what did the Lord uh Peter and Andrew was out fishing on a boat? They was out working, and guess what the Lord said? He said, uh, come follow me, I'll make you fishers of men. And then yeah, they that's put, right, that's right. And they put their nets down, and then they followed the Lord. And they stopped working, and then they <laughs> followed the Lord. So what the fuck is he talking about? He don't know, he don't know what the fuck Paul made about. tents. He just drive by scoffing. Then he drive by scoffing, hanging off the back of a pickup truck. And we walk by, he'll be all quiet, trying to start walk faster kind of and shit. He, doing? Was he, he on a truck, so he got all brave. Like, was he St. Matthew's 4 and was he, Did you get him on camera? Oh, you gotta start getting people on camera, man. Stupid. Yeah, I gotta stop. This doing zoom don't yeah, even that, work. That camera, man, I'm realizing oh, more and more, camera play is important. Yeah, you got to get all, everything you know, on camera. Because some bad motherfuckers on the camera pick everything up, man. They zoom in, zoom out. Try zooming in That's on that right now. That's why I know Alex Jones, man. The I got it on hot depth. sucks. The cameraman sucks on Alex Jones. That was zooming in, my man. But then let it focus. He it it takes a second to focus. He hats and shit. That's what it this is. Hatch, there's a fight going on right here, but he recording people's hats and they shit. They get it. It just takes a second to focus. Scared, scared. You know, in the crowd, fight with chaos going on, and motherfuckers hold the camera scared. You because know? that old camera does have a better zoom. Scared. In the battlefield, scared. Well, it's going to come to that point. There's gonna be so much shit going on. Them cameramen gonna get caught out there thinking they gonna just be journalists with a with a tag. They showed you that up in the, the uh, Baltimore. Right, right. Cameraman was getting fucked up. The <laughs> the, the little, Cops got fucked them up too. You see that bitch, uh, uh, that RT reporter up in Baltimore. They had a woman out there doing a man's job. First of all, was a totally off. That's a man's job <laughs> totally. going, going out in the battlefield. <laughs> right, right. But this bitch actually thought she could walk around with a camera doing reports in the middle of the hood. Right. Bitches, you got your fucking mind? Yeah. They, they, they knocked that bitch's camera down, stole her purse. And she still went And then she was shit? crying. Right. She was crying. Shit, Ukraine told that Russian bitch that worked for RT, bitch, we're going to kill you. You come back to this motherfucker. Who was that? I that, can't uh, remember which girl that's that cute one. I know what you're talking one? about. They said, we're going to kill you, bitch. There's warrants out for you, too. They going after her, man. They going after her. They, shit, RT came out and said that. America's on the way before they attack, if they were to do attack on, uh, um, uh, on Russia, they're going to go after RT first, their news outlets, their propaganda outlets. I'm surprised they even let RT operate in this country. Uh, well, you, the, well, you the know Russia what I'm allow some Americans in the They probably do, yeah. I, actually, I doubt that. Because you know, the um, uh, United States and Russia's got an agreement with their bombers. They allowed to fly yeah, over every, once in, every once in a while. They allowed to fly over and do a mapping of this. And that's, that's, that's crazy. crazy. That is crazy. That's crazy, man. That's fucking crazy. They're bombers? What? They're this intelligent. Ass trying to run. The motherfucking planes that go so far up you can't even see them motherfuckers, man. Yeah, they go up in the stratosphere. Hundred some thousand feet. But well, some commercial planes, I think they go 40, 30, I don't 40. Even know. Maybe oh, 50. Yeah, but they got the spy planes. Right, but they got those spy planes. But they got the spy like, planes that go so high, they got to wear special suits. Yeah, yeah, the oxygen, oxygen masks mask and everything. Yeah, just like yeah. the old school one, the, yeah. the Blackbird. That's the old shit. They got new shit now. Yeah, that, bad, that Blackbird was bad, too. I bet they got, I went down, when I was a, when I was young, we used to go down to the Dayton Air Force Museum. Right, right. You been down there? Right, you, right you can, Patterson. You can climb up into Blackbird. God damn. That's, that's what I'm talking about, man. Yeah, right Patterson. That's what I want to do, man. I, I went down to Dayton. I couldn't find it, though. Oh, that shit is huge. I couldn't find it. Though. Well, my dad was in the military, so. I've been to the one Rickerbacker here, though. 
Wrecking Bad. They had an air show here, bro. One of my flying. Oh, yeah, I remember that. Yeah, I ain't had, going to no air shows, bro. Yeah, the place been crashing. Yeah, they're crashing all the time. For some reason, they went flying that day, man. And they had that, um, that one that go way up. They don't have um, jet hour burners. Yeah. I forgot which plane it was. It's shaped like a triangle. It's stealth? It's, it's stealth, whatever. But that's how it was stealth, because they didn't have the, um, the afterburners outside the plane to see you. I don't, I can't explain how this shit works. Well, the radar couldn't pick up that heat signal. They got special uh, plating on it mm -hmm. that right, deflects right. radar signals. That shit ain't stealth, stealth no up. more. It ain't stealth, because Russia and China got... Um, Russia got plasma stealth. Yeah, they got that radar shit that picks up everything, man. That stealth is voided out. That's why they ain't fucking with Russia and China, man. Well, that's why he said Russia got uh, technology you can't fuck with. You can't even mind. Your mind can't even boggle, man. They got plasma stealth. I don't even know what that is. You don't even know what it plasma is. Plasma stealth. <laughs> I ain't some... never heard of him, be honest with you. Yeah. But I know Russia got some shit. America's last in technology now. Yeah. North Korea has surpassed American technology. Shit. They, the the hey, US specialist hey. says North Korea has advanced look, looks. Look, it's a fact that Seoul, South Korea, <laughs> is the most technologically advanced city on the earth. South Korea. They, they got internet speeds of over... I, I, I got to Google it, man. I want to say... A, it's gigabyte, gigabits per second. I don't know how many gigabits, but just, you should Google it. Well, Google it yourself. Google how fast CO's internet speed is. They, they got some of the fastest internet speeds in the world. They all shit supposed to be all sweet. Well, we, they, you get, you gotta pay like extra money to get 60 megabits, Wait, 100 they, megabits. Well, they tax you big time. A fucking that. megabit is slow as fuck. They got, they got gigabits in Korea. They tax the shit out of it for you. That's yeah, they, they, they we got what a uh, old decrepit ass infrastructure, man. Look at this old raggedy ass streets. <laughs> I was like look, looking up on pictures of CO on the internet. That shit looked like something from the future. This shit's all old and decrepit. Look, it still look like uh, 1950s post World War II. That's this when they is, built this shit. This is terrible, man. You know what I mean? Look at this shit. Old ass sewer systems. Shit is ancient. Yeah, some days we come out here stinks, don't we? Yeah, it stinks. You smell it, man. We just think of all the old ass pipes that's uh, all of our water's coming from. Yeah, water. That shit. Gas lines. All that shit's decaying. This shit, they use copper for it. Copper lines. Yeah, they used that to use hurts. lead. Ooh, that's even worse. <laughs> that'll make you, shit got lead out there. That'll make you hallucinate yeah. drinking that shit. That and you get fucked up on that lead. That'll make you go mad. Yeah, there's always water bus bursting around this bitch. Yeah, all these bushes. water mains busting, yeah, gas like lines busting. Mm. What's up, Esau? Mm. These are foul people, man. These are foul people. It's my pleasure to come out here and, and tell them how foul they are. Some foul. 